This video I'm making on request of a couple of people who are having trouble understanding the measurements that are needed for the harness. So I thought that I would do this to kind of help you guys out and understand and be able to better measure your dogs um, for our custom harnesses. Um, when I'm talking about girth, I need the measurement around the widest part of the rib cage. Um, and take into account that there is fleece padding under here too, so you might want to give an extra inch or so. Um, I also give a little bit extra um, when I make them, so if you gave me a measurement, like his measurement is 29 inches, um, I make that the, the smallest and then I add on extra because those shorter haired dogs um, usually wear coats in the winter time, um, especially here in Ohio. Um, the other measurement that I need is from the front of the breastbone, which is um, right in the center. It's a little piece that pokes out on your dog's chest all the way to right behind the shoulder blade. So that'll give me this distance that your dog is going to need. Again, give me the shortest distance. Um, there is a little bit of play with the, the Velcro in these so you can tighten them up about two inches um, and make them a little bit bigger, about two inches on either side. Um, the last measurement that I'll need is again from that breastbone between the legs all the way to where the girth strap would meet underneath the dog. Um, and again, give me the, you know, the shortest distance. Um, you can play around with that about an inch or two with the Velcro strap and how that adjusts on their chest also. Um, you have a couple of options um, with this harness. Um, you, can, um, you can have the D-ring on here or we can remove it for you. Um, a couple of people have um, asked for some Velcro on the side here, which is a really neat option to put a patch on here. We can also put the Velcro on the top um, for a patch. Uh, this handle on top is completely detachable. Um, so we can take it on or put it off. It comes with the harness um, as seen here. I think the handle is about 20 inches, maybe 22 inches um, standard. If you need that changed, um, you need to let me know that. Um, Sometimes I can get different colored fleece to put on the handle or the padding underneath as well as different colored webbings. Um, there is an extra charge for that, but it is available. Um, there are a couple people who have asked for the handle and the D-rings on their specific custom harnesses to attach on this way. Um, this handle is somewhat rigid um, so it does hold its shape but um, hold on a minute, bud. so if it were to be placed here it does have some stability in it so you could use it for some light mobility work um, but it's not going to have a ton um, if you extend the handle to a longer length that stability gets less and less, so just keep that in mind. Um, we can make the harnesses without these stabilizer pieces also, um, and then you can clip the harness on and use it more as a, a guide. Um, we also have different handles. We have different um, handle types, so there's the padded fleece, um, we can do an unpadded fleece, we can do a non-rigid, uh, we can do a rubber handle. Um, we, we have not tried a rubber handle with, a, with rigid sides, but um, I don't see why we couldn't do that. Um, and then you see in some of the pictures um, on our website or the Facebook page, um, the different packs. So we have a pack that sits on either side of the dog and we have a single pack that sits on the back. Um, I can pretty much get it in red all the time, um, but sometimes available are green, yellow, um, blue, 
and a couple of other colors. Um, just kind of depends on what's available at the store at the time. Um, so if you have any questions about the harness, um, you can always email me. Here, come here. I'm going to show the front of the harness. Back, get back. Close. Good. So this is the front of the harness and the different adjustability with it. Um, if you do not want the piece that goes between the legs, um, we can do a single adjustable strap that goes around the front. Um, that is fine too. That can be padded or not padded. Um, that just depends on what you want with that. So just let us know and we'll be happy to make your custom harness for you.